Boys hockey was coming off a huge win over Braintree this past weekend, which improved them to 500 on the season. They would look to secure a winning record when they also hosted Milton on Wednesday, February 8th. These two teams met back in early January and they tied 2-2. It's the only tie Needham currently has on their record. The boys are looking to make the postseason for the first time since 2019. And at this stage, every game counts. So, could the Rockets overcome the Wildcats for their second straight victory? Let's find out. Early on in the first, Rockets trying to clear the puck from their end, but John Sullivan gets in the way, intercepts it, but Dylan Michaelo there to deflect the shot away. Eight and a half now to go in the first. Milton attacking early. This time it's Cameron McDonough who launches a shot, but Michaelo denies it. Just over a minute now to go. Wildcats having opportunities in this first. Barry Berg with a nice look inside, but Milton cannot take advantage, so we are tied at zero after one. Rockets would be aggressive in the second. Jimmy Kenny swings over to Neil O'Malley, who takes a shot, but right in the chest of Andrew McHugh. Five minutes now into the period, Tommy Peabody would have an open shot here at McHugh, but he comes up big with the save. Needham, though, would stay aggressive throughout the period. Off a face-off win here, Spencer Clark flings the puck wide to Matt Rutter, and he's able to bury it over the shoulder of McHugh. Rockets strike first, and they lead 1-0. Wildcats would try to answer. Declan Walsh takes the puck from the defense, has space, takes a shot, but that brick wall known as Michael O there to deny it. Heading now into the final period, Will O'Donnell here with some open ice, has Rudder with him. He finds him, but the shot just goes too high. Under five minutes to go, Needham still leading by one, moving the puck smoothly up the ice, ends up in the stick of O'Donnell, but another huge save here made by McHugh. Game still going, 120 remaining. Milton trying to get it out there and instead, the puck finds Jake Sikowski open up top. He floats one in and it would go in off the skate of Milton. Just like that, the Rockets lead by two. Uh, Wildcats now with an empty net and the Rockets would take advantage. Will Saratella gets past the defense and puts it in. And this one is all over. After back and forth period and a half, Rockets come alive and take the win over Milton, three to nothing. This improves them to 8-7-1 on the season, and they'll look to get their third in the row when they host Walpole on Saturday, February 11th at 6.30 p.m.